Hey, the summer months allow you to experience something unique to Detroit at a historic part of the city that has been bringing people together for decades. Tuesday markets at Eastern Market have become a summer tradition. And while it includes much of what you'll find on a Saturday market, there are special events happening only on Tuesdays as well. Kyla Peoples is out at Shed 5 this morning. Beer, 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 beer. Where a class is underway that's bringing kids together. Good morning, Kyla. Good morning, you guys. I wish you guys could smell how good the food that they are preparing in here smells right now. It's summer cooking classes at the community kitchen here in Shed 5 at Eastern Market. And we're here with Anika Summer. She is the head of nutritional education here at uh, Eastern Market. How are you? Doing wonderful. Awesome. Now tell us a little bit about the cooking classes that they have here. What, are, what, is, what do they learn here? What do they get to do here? We have cooking classes for the summer in Shed 5 for kids of, who are 8 until 15 years of age here in the market. And this summer we are going around the world. Wow. Okay, so Kev, you got to show them some of these hamburgers that they're making right now. They look so good, exciting things for the summer. I think that they're making some mac and cheese, they're making some burgers, they're making some green beans, they're making some delicious uh, German potato salad, it's great. Actually, we're gonna come and talk to a, a couple, look at these kids, they're cutting up cheeses and everything. Like, I've been, they've been working so hard. Let me tell you, how you doing, ladies? Good. Look how cute they are. I wanna have them cook in my kitchen. What's your name, sweetie? Morgan. Morgan, tell me, um, is this your first class or have you done this before? It's my first class. What do you think about it so far? Um, I really like it. What do you like about it? Um, I can learn how to cook some more burgers. I can learn how to, um, Make some fresh mac and cheese also. So what's your favorite so far? Are you the burgers or the mac and cheese? The mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. That's my favorite too. I love mac and cheese. Yeah. And who's your who's your friend here? My sister. Uh, oh, they're sisters. Okay, what's your name, sister? Monet. Monet, tell me, what do you like about the class so far? Um, I like how you can experience more things to cook on your own. And now, what are you going to do now that you've learned, you're learning how to cook, what are you going to do with it? you think you're going to become a chef, maybe? Um, I don't know, maybe. Is there anything in particular you want to learn how to cook? Um, like baking foods, like cupcakes and cakes and stuff like that. So she wants to be a pastry chef, which is amazing, and that's something they, they probably do learn. Anika, do they learn that? Do they learn how to make uh, pastries as well? They will get to learn how to make some pastry, pastries, but those are classes that we have on Saturdays. So not only do we have cooking classes on Tuesdays, but we also have cooking classes on Saturdays. And we have them for adults, intergenerational, and kids, and those rotate. That's great. So you said that you're learning how to cook stuff from around, ooh, excuse me, you're learning how to cook stuff from around the world. What does that mean? So we're taking cuisine from all over the world. So kids are going to learn how to cook food from Italy, foods from Japan, foods from very different um, flavors and cultures so that they have a, an opportunity to really expand their taste buds because if you learn to cook something different then that broadens your opportunity to really have a chance to learn something new and then do you use a lot of the stuff that you that is sold here at Eastern Market as well yes we do so we always try to procure foods from the market vendors and also the businesses that are located here in the market that's awesome so as you can see, they're making bacon, they're cooking all kinds of stuff. They're actually using the stoves. It's so awesome. And they, like I said, like Anika said, they are using the stuff that is found right here in the other sheds at Eastern Market. And we're actually going to travel over there and see what else is uh, on sale, actually, or available at Eastern Market. And we're going to have a little taste test of a couple of things, too. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Back to you guys. Yeah, they'll bring some food back, Randy. Don't worry. Randy's all over. <laughs> Thank you, <laughs> Kyla. <laughs> Remember, Tuesday markets run until 3 p.m. now through September. So check them out after the show.